Hi, Chapter 7 talks about many of the map overlay and geoprocessing applications that ArcGIS has. We're going to talk about one here called the CLIP. You can see here for all the state of North Carolina, we have all of the schools. What I want to do is run a CLIP so I can just only get those schools that lie within the boundary of Durham City. And you can see Durham City is highlighted in purple. You can see the strange shape because of annexation and other things that go on with respect to zoning that define the shape of Durham City. And you can see it right here. I just want to find all those blue dots. I want to do analysis so I can only find those blue points that lie within the boundary of Durham, North Carolina right here. And I can do so using a clip right here. I don't want to work with any of the other 2,500 or so dots, 2,500 or so points that we have here. And typically, a clip is used as a data preparation tool. Whether we have a map extent or a county or whatever we're working with, we just want to find, run a spatial clip to find all those layers within, all of those features within a particular layer. So it acts as a bit of a cookie cutter here. And you can see I've activated my Arc Toolbox here by clicking in the red toolbox up here. And you'll see that it's docked over wherever you specify. And I can click on Analysis, Extract, and I can click on Clip right here. And in my dialog right here, I have my input features. My input features from my drop down right here are going to be my schools. My clip feature, that's going to be my cookie cutter, is going to be Durham City. I just want those within the city. And then my output, well, I'm going to specify this in my GIS demo folder here. I'm going to call this schools. And these are going to be in decimal degrees. And these should all have the same projections here. Okay, and when I'm all set here, I'm going to click OK. You can see in the bottom right here, it's telling me that the clip is running. Usually after a couple of seconds, if there's going to be a problem with the spatial or attribute data, it's going to, it'll uh, give me an error. But it's running pretty well right here. It takes a little bit. This is a very resource intensive application right here. Okay, it's still running here. Okay. And then over here it tells me that the clip ran in the right bottom right corner here. And then here we are. Here are my schools right here. Only these ones in green lie within the boundary of Durham City. You can notice there's a couple of a couple of them here that fall right outside here. Okay, we can look at this one right here. I believe I can click on this dot. This is Northern High School. You notice right here, Northern High School just lies outside of the Durham City limits right here. Okay, just outside here, so it's not included within that particular GIS data layer right here. We've got a couple, of, a couple other ones here near the boundary here. Okay, so you can see what this clip does right here. Okay, I can right mouse click, zoom to layer, and now these are all my schools. Now, these are only the schools within Durham city limits using the CLIP operation.